guys! So today I am doing another Halloween look. This one is a um, cracked porcelain doll kind of a look and um, it was requested by a friend of my sister's. So yeah, let's get started. Well, I'm just using the Ideal Flawless Foundation from Avon in Ivory and just putting that all over my face. You want to use a color that's a little bit lighter than your skin because porcelain dolls are very fair skinned. Then using the Zoeva Concealer Palette in the lightest shade, you're just going to be covering up any imperfections you might have on your face. Then I'm using the Zoeva 110 face shape brush and just buffing in all the um, concealer that I've just applied. And now using this eyeshadow brush and the shade TO or 2 from my Croylon blusher palette and you're just going to be applying that all over the lid and extending it up a little bit because you know you want to make your eyes look like they're a little bit bigger. Then using a crease eyeshadow brush and the color 81 from the same Croylon blusher palette, you're just going to be applying that kind of in like a V on the outer corner of the eye and just blending that out too with the same fluffy brush. Then using the Maybelline Master Precise Liquid Eyeliner in black, I'm going to just be lining the top lid of my eye and extending it down a little bit to make the eye look a little bit more big. Then just using any kind of an angled eyeliner brush and a brown eyeshadow, you're just going to be creating the lower lid and you're just going to be going from the corner of the eyeliner that you pulled down and just making it come around as a lower lid. I don't know if that makes sense. Then using the Maybelline Line Refine Liquid Eyeliner, you're going to be pulling that right above that brown eyeshadow line, but me, I forgot to press record. So here is a reactment of that. Then using any kind of dramatic eyelashes, you are going to be opening that eyelash glue like a lady and applying those eyelashes on your eyes. Then using these wispy little eyelashes, you are going to be cutting them into pieces of two, so like one longer strand, one shorter strand, and you're going to be applying these separately onto your lower, your new lower lash line. Using my Manhattan eyebrow pencil in brownie, you're going to be enhancing your eyebrows, making them very thin and doll-like. And you're also going to be using this same eyebrow pencil to make freckles on your face. Then using the Catrice Prime and Fine Mattifying Powder and Translucent, I'm just going to be putting this all over my face to get rid of any shininess and to kind of powder over the freckles and make them look not as extreme. But we're going to be using the Zoeva Concealer Palette, so the same color that we used all over our face, the lightest shade, and we're just going to really make sure that our lips are blended into the rest of our face. Using the Croylon Contour Pencil in 906, which is a very bright pink color, we're going to be drawing those little mini lips and filling in, filling those tiny little lips in with the pencil. Then I'm going to use my MAC lipstick in, I'm pretty sure it's Girl About Town, and we're just going to be covering, the going over the same, like the lip liner with the lipstick. Then just using a thin liner brush and black face paint, you can also use any eyeliner or any other black makeup, we're going to be, start creating 
um, the cracks on our face. So you're just going to be making like a little shape and then doing little hairline cracks coming off of this. You can do as many as you want all over your face. If you just want one, that's fine. If you want a bunch, that's also good. So just let your mind wander. This is me realizing that I just made a swastika out of my cracks. Oops. And there you go, this is the finished look.